Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. In this video, we will prepare a development environment for .NET developers on Mac. As you may already know, Microsoft officially announced that Visual Studio on Mac has been retired as of August 31st, 2024, in line with the Microsoft Modern Lifecycle Policy. For more details, you can find the announcement link from Microsoft below. Luckily, they offer a solution for Mac users who want to develop .NET on their Mac. Let's get started. Open Safari and search for .NET SDK on Google. Go to the official Microsoft website to download it. Select the right option for your Mac's configuration. Double click to install it. Allow your Mac to install the SDK. You can move the installer to the trash. I have already installed Visual Studio Code on my computer, but if you need a guide to install it, you can find the related video link below in the description. Open Visual Studio Code. Click the Extensions tab on the left, search for the C Sharp Dev Kit and click Install. Your .NET development environment is ready to use once the installation is complete. If the uninstall button is active, you can be sure that the installation has been successfully completed. Click Explorer on the left, then click the Create .NET Project button. I will now demonstrate the development environment with a console application and a web application. VS Code will display a list of project options you can create. Let's select console application for this demonstration. Enter your project's name. Press enter or click create project to create it in the specified location. Your project has been created. Locate program CS and double click on it. Then click Run at the top. VS Code will ask you to select a debugger and list the available options. Select the suggested debugger and it will also ask you to select a launch configuration for your project. Your Mac may ask for permission to take control. Click it using your credentials. You will see the famous and friendly Hello World message in the debug console at the bottom. Write your own code and test it if you'd like. Now let's demonstrate the web application. Close the current application by clicking Close folder in the file menu. Click the Explorer tab and then click Create.NET Project. Select ACP.NET Core Web Application for this demonstration. Enter your project's name and press Enter. Your application is now ready to go. Explore the project files on the left.
Let's run the project. VS Code will ask you to select a debugger and list the available options. Select the suggested debugger, and it will also ask you to select a launch configuration for your project. Choose the suggested option. Here we go, our project welcomes us in the browser. You can debug your project just like you did in Visual Studio. Let's try it briefly. If you like using AI-supported IntelSense in Visual Studio, go ahead and install the IntelliCode for c -sharp Dev Kit extension. Search for it using the extension search bar and install it just like we did for the c -sharp Dev Kit extension. Let's try it in our example project. You'll see recommended lines of code displayed in grey as shadows. That's it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content.